Jamali has a drawer containing 6 green socks, 18 purple socks, and 12 orange socks. After adding more purple socks, Jamal noticed that there is 60% chance that a sock randomly selected from the drawer is purple. How many purple socks did, J did Jamal add? So basically, try to just simulate this event out. I have 6 green socks, right? I have 18 purple socks, and I have 12 orange, right? And from this total population, we add more purple socks. So let's say I add X number purple socks, so we have a total of 18 plus X purple socks in the end, right? So Jamal noticed that there was a 60% chance that when I select a sock on random, the, the, the uh, sock is purple. So it's a probability question, but what is, the, what is the definition of a probability? Well, the probability of X happening is equal to the number of cases, right, that works over the total number of cases. So from this understanding, we can say that, in other words, the probability that I take a sock out and it's purple will be the number of purple socks, right, in the drawer over the total number of socks from this definition of probability. So what is this probability? Well, the number of purple socks now is 18 plus X. And how many socks do I have in total? We'll have 6 plus 12 plus 18 plus X. So that's equal to 18 plus 18 plus X, which is 36 plus X. So this is our total, 36 plus X. But we know that this is equal to 60%. 60%, right, is equal to 6 over 10. So therefore, we can say that this is equal to, after simplifying, 3 over 5. So what is X from this expression? Well, cross-multiply first, right? <coughs> we would have 90 plus 5X is um, 108 plus 3X. Therefore, 2X is equal to uh, 18, therefore x is equal to 9. Therefore, I added a total of 9 socks into the drawer.